Paul Stranger, Stephen Stretch, Colin Good, Exodus Project, AmericanCultureTV.com. That is uh, Bussier, Bussier City Police here. Bossier City. That is officer, no, it's uh, unit number 26. Louisiana. We keep an eye on TJ. Right outside Shreveport. Check out TJ, make sure everything's going well with him. So this guy's obviously doing something to uh, appear to be harassing right now. Him and walking out here, with TJ. Let him know he's being watched. So as you can see here, TJ, cops watching you. So TJ's out here, the stop sign here. See here's the electric pole. Two of these. Look over here. Do you want? See, there's a right of way here. You got street utility, street drainage. And you'll notice right here, in this area right here, you'll see the separation of where the job is done here for the city. And here we got a caution clearance. There is no sign saying no soliciting anywhere. And as you can see, there's a sign there from Twisted Burger Company Root, Twisted Root Burger Company, which does not belong to Walmart at all. And that's located right here. But nothing meets it out to this where we see the fire hydrant right here, which is obviously the right of way. Along with this right here, you see City Electric right here. And there you go. So there's your view of Benzlo. Are the police pulling up? We'll find out if they're gonna stop him and harass him or, or not. There we go, we gotta sit on the right of way. Captured if it does. It appears that the Busier City is going to broker a deal to get us trespassed off of Walmart. That police there pulling around. He reached over and went back to Walmart. So I'm gonna let TJ know about that situation. Alright, so he looked like he was doing a U turn. He took a look right back in here. I'm gonna watch the city pulls up in the front of Walmart and try to broker a deal. I uh, see my broker deal. You gotta move the van. So, I'll go back in and I'll catch him. Pastor Ranger Stevens, Church Common Good, and I saw it. It's this project. So, we just saw in Bozier City, in Louisiana, two officers. One officer was, uh, appears to be brokering a deal to get a trespass warning. Hey. Hey, no, I see you on a call. Yeah, I am. I'm sorry, I won't bother you while you're doing your duties. Hey, come here. Yes, sir. Do you got me on? Do I have my ID on me? Yeah. Why do I need my ID? They need to identify you because you've been evicted from this property. I've been evicted from this property. Did you just broker that deal by chance? No, I went in there to ask. Are you panhandling? No, I'm not. No, actually, I'm actually. Identify yourself. Oh, my name is Pastor Andrew Stevens, Church of Common Good. You can always have a checks and balances sure. on YouTube. Walk, walk right over there. Here for me. Okay. So you step over there. Yeah. Like, right over I, there. I, I'm not going to handle it all. I don't think you're looking at the right person. Okay, that's fine. Right. Stand up here. Can I identify Well, okay. Uh, well, yeah. this this is uh, in Louisiana. Oh, yeah. Walk over there, time. Oh, and now I'm being detained, uh, guys. Yeah. So you got to watch this. Yeah, that's pretty I'm awesome. being detained. Stand right here. You come right here, bud. Yeah. All right. Yeah, we're going to go ahead. No, no, I'm going to keep recording. I have a right, but ACLU. Listen, you're reading a report right here? I'm, right I'm here. recording my own documentation. I got you. I can give you my information, but right now I'm not suspected of the crime. If you're trying to be a victim, you leave. But I'm not suspected of the crime, and what you're doing right now is, is being real hard-handed. Okay. And that's what we're doing. We're auditing police officers. Take, you your, phone. Take your phone. Take your phone and send it on the um, phone. I'm going to be your supervisor. Okay. Well, I mean, I might be being evicted. You, you can set your phone Am I free to go? No, you're not free to go. What am I being suspected of? Can you please? I'll take you later back. Now you're after being forbidden, okay? One. 
You're remaining on private property. Nobody told me to leave. Hold on, you're, well, nobody told me to leave. I'm trying to tell you that you're being evicted. Well, if you're trying to tell me, tell me. Let me leave. Set your phone on the Okay, why would I, how am I remaining here? I'm not going to go, brother. You're not going to turn it right here. You're like, on. I need someone. Set it right here. Hold on. Oh, yeah. You put it on one window. I don't even want it on your property. I'm going to put it right here. I'm going to go record it this one, too. Take it out of your hands, okay? I don't care what you're doing. Take it out of your hands. Take it out of your hands. Take it out of your hands. All right. You would please provide me with your identification. Right? I don't have an ID for you on me. Okay. And then stop the ID state. Stand right there. Well, hold on. So just stay in between. What is your name? Listen, you're, you're actually. Stop talking and listen to me. I'm, I'm asking you, what is your name? You're violating my rights. rights. My name is Jim. Pastor Andrew Stevens, Church okay. of Common Church, 730, 1978. 730, 78. Now, Connie, be quiet. Andrew Stevens, 730-78. And I'm not paying handling at all. I didn't say you were paying handling. I said you were being That's what you said. There's a complaint that there were two paying handlers by the end. And the manager said he wanted you evicted. You actually, okay. I, we, we recorded it. Now I'm going to need your name, for, sir. Okay, it's right here. And and it'll be on the I board. can't see it. No, all I need to know your name no, is Merritt, M-A-R-R-M-E-R-R-O-T-T, Thames. Officer Tim. Officer Tim, Merritt and Tims. Is that your badge number, sir? Right there, 3587. Well, you're really dictating where I'm not suspected of a crime if I'm being evicted from property. Listen, I'm not a lawyer, and you're not a lawyer. No, I actually, I'm an ACLU investigator, sir. Okay, I'm you're a lawyer. I'm an ACLU investigator. I got you. Are you a lawyer? I have an attorney. You Talk to him? No, I'm not. I don't call my phone. Leave it right I'll call my attorney right now. I'm not a lawyer. I said you're not an attorney. No, no we okay? crossed the country. So we're not going to court right now. I'm going to dictate what's going to happen. And then after the fact, if you want to get an attorney, you can do whatever you want to do. That's okay, well sir. within your rights. I know. Okay? But when I receive a complaint, I investigate that complaint. And right now, you're hindering that side. So if I okay. do, listen. Just be quiet. Let us finish what we're going to do. And then you can go. Okay. At this point, don't touch the phone. Right At this point in time, I'm going to the Fifth Amendment. Okay, good. And I don't want to hurt anybody else. Thank you. Just remain silent. Do that. Mm. Which way do you spell Stevens, uh, Mr. Andrew? Okay, you have to answer that. Please identify yourself, sir. Don't worry. S-T-E-P-H-E-N-S. There you go. Okay. Now you may continue. Thank you, Stevens. Which way right there? Cool. Okay. Hey, I'm sure you know that I've been recording all the time. I told you you've been recording all the time. I knew that. Okay, set it back in your pocket like I asked you. I'm not going to tell you again. The next time we're going to have an issue. All right? All Let you... me explain to you something. In Louisiana, when you visit a store, the store's purpose is to buy a product. Yes, I was just going to buy a product. Thing. Okay, I got that. I'll yeah. see a bag off your receipt. No, that's good. Me. I'm talking, not you. So when we get a complaint that somebody here doing non-business related items, whether, whether it's... Uh, Panhandling, soliciting, or whatever it is you're doing, this is not a place me? to fill. I'm just saying, I received a complaint. I checked the manager, and the manager said he wanted to evict it off the property. Really? I've been reporting since I got here. Right, but you, okay, you're, you keep saying this, but you're talking about somebody else's difference. I'm the guy who actually records when other people do what's called an audit on the right-of-way, which uh, is not on my property. Uh, I'm the guy who actually keeps the data to show whether police are falsely using the ordinances that were used for costing purposes and traffic coalition. You, you have absolutely okay. cost me. Um, absolutely you cost me. Your, your people after I, yeah, that's what we do. That's what we do for a living, brother. Okay, that's what we do. Yeah. If I was wearing a suit and tie, you would feel it. I don't care what you're wearing. Well, your city okay. manager will understand. Okay, I, I don't know the city manager. Uh, yeah, okay. I know the city manager. I don't care what you're wearing. Very, very wearing. Wearing. Okay. You're, you're doing right now is going to violate the Constitution rights. My first, fourth, and fifth amendment rights. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cool. And we regularly get 20 30 dollars dollars sell dollars in this work. Right of way is not owned by pri uh, private property. Private property owner cannot have dictation of a public property, and the complainant is not with you. Who's the complainant in this case? The complainant is the manager I talked to. Uh, the manager should be out here signing the complaint, right? Okay. Listen, that does not matter. It doesn't? No. Well, your IA can tell me If someone's been punched in the face, I don't need to bring your victim up to the suspect. There's no victim here. There's a victim of offense that's not even okay. committed. Okay. I'm well, under well, investigation called as Terry Stop, right? Or the welfare check? Stop talking. Okay. You haven't articulated the facts you're suspicious of. Okay. That's because I'm not required to articulate them to you. No. Okay? Okay. I'll be quiet. Thank you. You heard that, right? So, Felipe, this is Officer Marriott. 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 Pronounce like the hotel. Marriott. M-E-R-R-I-O-T, I think, right? He's got two T's. Two T's. With the... Bozier, B O S S I E R. Bozier, City, Louisiana Police Department. He was working on his own, half, his own behalf, from my understanding. Got a complaint about our auditor, who is not myself, and he's harassing me because I stopped asking if he was on a call. But I'd also recorded him earlier, as you saw. 
Yeah, oh, I recorded an officer right over there. Yeah, well, watching somebody on the right of way. Over here. You want to back up then? Well, that doesn't matter. I'm just telling you. I have the uh, unit number from out there. You're, it's not that unit, it's this unit. Okay, well then it wasn't me then. No, I'm sorry. I, I apologize for being small. I'm not saying facts. I'm saying uh, hypothesis right now. My hypothesis is that you're acting uh, in accordance to, not in accordance to your policies, procedures, or constitutional law. That's my hypothesis. Right. And you do a warrant check. I can go, go ahead and do a... Uh, I can do a um, public record search. I'm not checking anything. If you can get just wait wherever you're coming from, wait back over there. Thank oh, you. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt you. That's all right. Thank you. All right. Little wife and kids don't know I'm not being or, 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 uh, accosted right now either, though. And you are, you are making everybody believe that I'm doing something illegal, which I'm not. I haven't told anybody you've done anything illegal. So you had me here accosting me. Okay. Like I said, take it up with somebody after the fact. Oh, why will be? You should check our YouTube video out. We're pretty good at this. We've been doing it for years, many, many years. That's great. Photography is not a crime. You familiar with us? I am not. BNAC. Photography is not a crime. Check it out. So as you know, that I'm going to go ahead and find out if you brokered this deal or if you brokered this deal, right? There's no deal. Well, Walmart doesn't have control over the right of way. So, okay. hey, Listen yeah. The more that you talk, the more that you're filling this conversation with noise that does not help or hinder your case in any way. So I can explain to you like I already have. What case? Okay, I'm telling you, I was advised by the manager here that there was two people that they thought were engaged in some stage out. I was we watched the list. You watched the right away. Uh, mm -hmm. I was told by somebody that he wore it was a tie-dye shirt. So I see you walk up and say, hey, are you on a call? And I turn around and go, oh, that's the guy. No, that's so not So that's true. why I detained you so I can identify you. Because so I'm wearing a tie-dye shirt, huh? Yeah. Ooh. So you just harass people with tie-dye shirts? <laughs> Only when I get a complaint that there's a white male in a tie-dye shirt is the one that they want to evict. Okay. Well, why do you want to talk to the guy who's in a tie-dye shirt out there on the right of way? Well, you, then I'll go talk to him. But he's not on private property. He's not on private property. Okay, well, then I can still go over there and, and tell him that he's been evicted from Walmart. Well, he's not in Walmart. Okay. So you can't, because you can't, you can't so trespass somebody. You can tell me what I can and can't do. Okay? I'm familiar with trespassing in regards to me being on property. Okay, listen to me. I'm telling you that what we can do at the time being and what you can sue for later is Yeah, here. I know. Okay, so if Walmart doesn't want you here, you've got to go uh, to the I know that. Okay? Absolutely not. He said, I'm telling you what we can do in the time being, what you can see for later or doing things. He's a white guy, and I'm a white guy. Well, I mean, I got his cruiser number. He's basically saying, I'll do something you can see for, I ain't worried about it. Yeah, I ain't got a warrant, man. Yeah, I know. You know who I do? This is Andrew Stevens, Church Common Good, Exodus Project, American Culture, TV.com. I'm here at the, in the, uh, near Shreveport in a small area called Bothier City. And I'm going to speak with uh, Sergeant Warren concerning the uh, egregious activity being performed by the officers in this area, who is a watch commander. We already spoke to this, uh, this, uh, the other sergeant that's on duty this time, which are the highest level officers today. And we were not able to find any uh, resolution uh, in that way. So we are going to go over here and speak to Officer uh, Sergeant Warren concerning the same. And we are going to go ahead and find out if that's something, if he can take the complaint in a more proper fashion. So thank you very much. Talk to you soon.